A championship soccer game between rivals turns ugly. Fist fly and it's mm -hmm. all caught on cell phone video. KCAL News reporter Joy Benedict has reaction from some of the players who were there and what the brawl means for the team's playoff future. It started as a celebration, but quickly turned violent. As fish started flying at the end of the city championship soccer match between El Camino Real and Birmingham Charter. It just got crazy. Uh, there was a lot of taunting, but it's part of the game. It was a rival game. Damian Lopez is a senior on Birmingham's team. He and his teammates admit things got out of hand. I got choked. But me and him both kept our cool because like our main focus is state. But as if this wasn't bad enough, both teams saw their season end when the CIF ruled neither team could advance to the regional competition. That's unfair because a lot of us are seniors and we all kept our cool, especially the ones that play. And it wasn't fair to us. These players say usually the CIF, which is the governing body over LA City High School sports, will just suspend a player involved, not one team, and certainly not two. Our main goal was to win the game and keep our cool, but I guess other players couldn't keep that same mentality. The CIF put out a statement saying, in part, respect and integrity towards each other prior, during, and after a contest is of utmost priority. Neither high school chose to contest the decision, and El Camino Real's head coach said in a statement to KCAL News, I agree with this decision, as our program should be held in the highest of standards. Decisions these young people have to learn to live with. Do you understand why the decision was made? At some part, yeah, but... I understand. We all understand. Kind of just kind of trying to get over it. There's nothing we can really do now. Birmingham made it to state last year, losing in the title game. They also won Saturday. And with 16 seniors on its team, they were looking forward to one more chance at a championship. But now they will have to settle for a lesson that will clearly resonate on fields for years to come. Just a little sad about it because it was our last year. And I felt like our team can could have won it all. No one remembers the game we played. No one like the great game we played. It's just Birmingham goes out as like the team who fought and like lost everything. Both teams would have competed Tuesday in that regional competition. Instead, both of their competitors each got a bye. From Woodland Hills, I'm Joy Benedict, KCAL News.